Have you ever accepted Jesus Christ as your personal savior? Before you answer, let me explain the question. To fully understand this question, you must first properly understand Jesus Christ, personal, and savior. Who is Jesus Christ? Many people will admit that Jesus Christ was a good man, a great teacher, or even a prophet of God. This is definitely true of Jesus, but it does not describe Jesus as who he really is. The Bible tells us that Jesus is God in the human body. God became man, see John chapter 1 verses 1 to 14. God came to earth to teach us, heal us, guide us, forgive us, and die for us. Jesus Christ is God, the Creator, the Sovereign Lord. Have you accepted this Jesus? What is a Savior, and why do we need a Savior? The Bible tells us that we have all sinned and committed evil deeds, Romans chapter 3 verses 10 to 18. As a result of our sin, we are worthy of God's wrath and judgment. The only just punishment for sins against an eternal and infinite God is eternal punishment, Romans chapter 6 verse 23. That is why we need a Savior. Jesus Christ came to earth and died in our place. When Jesus died, as God in the human body, it was the eternal payment for our sins, 2 Cor 5 21. Jesus died to pay the penalty for our sins, Romans chapter 5 verse 8. Jesus paid the price so we do not have to pay. When Jesus rose from the dead, he proved that his death was a sufficient payment for our sins. That is why Jesus is the only Savior, John chapter 14 verse 6, Acts chapter 4 verse 12. Do you trust Jesus as your Savior? Is Jesus your personal Savior? Many people view Christianity as going to church, performing rituals and not committing certain sins. It is not Christianity. True Christianity is having a personal relationship with Jesus Christ. Accepting Jesus as your personal Savior means that you have a personal faith and trust in Him. No one can be saved through the faith of others. No one is forgiven for doing certain good deeds. The only way to be saved is to accept Jesus as your Savior, trusting that Jesus paid your punishment and that His resurrection is your guarantee of eternal life, John chapter 3 verse 16. Is Jesus personally your Savior? If you want to receive Jesus Christ as your personal Savior, say the following words to God. But remember, saying this prayer or any other prayer cannot save you. Only through faith and trust in Christ can you be saved from sin. God, I know I have sinned against you and deserve punishment. But Jesus Christ took the punishment I deserve so that by believing in him I can be forgiven. I turn away from my sin and believe that salvation exists only in you. I accept Jesus as my personal Savior. Thank you for wonderful grace, forgiveness and eternal life as a gift. Amen. Quote.